So here's the story. I'm changing planes in London and I get a phone call from Roger at McLaren. And he says, Nick, since you're in London, will you stop over and drive a car for me? I said, all right, Roger, what do you got? And he says, I got something that's worth less than a million dollars. He's got my interest. And he says, it's a 720S. And I said, I'm in, Roger. And here it is. Now, all we need to know is it goes zero to 60 miles an hour in 2.6 seconds. Now I'm impressed. McLaren is the closest thing to a performance race car that I have ever driven on the streets. It drives like something that should be on the racetrack, and it looks like something that should be on the racetrack. Now, everything you see on this 720S is absolutely functional. There's nothing put on this car just for looks. Every vent, every hole has a purpose, and this vehicle is loaded with carbon fiber. It looks beautiful too. Famous for their aluminum monocoque shell, McLaren are masters at making things strong and light. The Spider, or soft top, takes considerably more engineering than the hard top. Now, of course, it's a McLaren, which means it's got very cool doors. But do note, this is different than the coupe version, because the coupe version, which has a solid roof, the doors are attached both at the side here and on the roof. But in this version, the doors are actually only attached in one place. Now, they are soft open and soft closed doors. So when you close them, the door completes the task on its own. But like any McLaren, it's a bit of a task getting into the vehicle when you're an old man. So once I'm in, I'm not climbing out again. I'm spending the rest of the day in here. So climbing in it. Ugh. 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 Now I'm in. It's time to see what it sounds like when I get it started. And that sound never disappoints. Perhaps the English country roads were a bad choice to test drive the 720S. Now this vehicle has a V8 with 710 horsepower put this on the track it's a race car it's absolutely amazing in fact it's so amazing if this had a bathroom I'd live in it inquiring minds want to know what is the top speed it's 212 miles an hour if I wasn't on a little English country road that is Sorry, how fast was the top speed? 212 miles an hour! And just in case you wanted to know... If you're asking about fuel economy, I'm presuming you're asking about it because you care about the environment, not because you care about how much it's going to cost to operate this vehicle. The truth is, you get 22 miles a gallon on the highway. But I don't care about 22 miles a gallon on the highway. I just care about the environment. And just in case you wanted to take it for a weekend trip. Now, McLaren love their frunks, and so they have put a frunk at the front of this vehicle. There is actually enough room to get a couple of overnight bags in here. I'm Nick Miles.